personal finance in five minutes. Family introduction. So you got yourself. You are Ariel Davis. You are 44 years old and work as a multimedia artist. You also have a husband. His name is Black Knight. He is 46 years old and works as a chemist. You two get to your jobs by car. The both of you have two children. A son named Zachary who is 16 and a daughter named Tamara who is 14. The four of you live in Newark, Delaware and are pretty much like everyone else. Your lifestyle is typical enough to be normal and exciting enough to not be boring. You go out to the movies, have game nights, you know, just like any other family. Career Summary Hey you there, the one that doesn't have 20-20 vision. Tell us about your job. Well, I work as a multimedia artist. I do animations and visual effects for TV shows, video games, movies, and more. I work with computer programs to create graphics, research projects to help make realistic designs, make storyboards, plan out keyframes for animations, edit works based on feedback, and meet with other animators, clients, and directors to review work. Typically, the education required for this job is a bachelor's degree in computer graphics, art, or a related field. I really enjoy this job because drawing is something that I think I'm good at and that I really like to do. Being able to get paid to draw and do digital art is pretty great. The likely income of Miss Davis and her spouse would be about $1,038,350. Home Purchase Our family is living in a house in Newark, Delaware located at 14 Woodshaw Road. This house costs $3,059,900 and is a single family house with a finished basement and an attic. It has a garage with two parking spaces, a fireplace, security system, and a pool. In total, it has four bedrooms, three bathrooms, and is 2,300 square feet in size. The down payment on this house was $71,980. The interest rate was 3.5% with a fixed 15-year mortgage and a monthly payment of about $2,500. Now you've seen the family room, the attic, the pool, and oh, what's behind this door? It's... <laughs> Auto Purchase It seems that the two have settled on a new 2016 Hyundai Elantra SE for the price of $14,200. We thought this car was a good choice because of its many features, such as blind spot mirrors and a rear view camera, a built-in navigation system and 7-inch screen right on the dashboard. It also has cruise control, useful for anyone who has trouble keeping a steady speed. There's also a hands-free Bluetooth device to connect to your phone. Plus, there's enough space for the whole crew and a guest. Ooh, can I tag along? You are dead to me. Family budget. Miss Davis and Mr. Knight's joint monthly income is $11,529. Minus $3,228 on taxes, their monthly net income is $8,301. Their total monthly expenses is $8,038 with $263 left over. Their total annual expenses is $96,456. Saving and investing. As said before, each month this family saves $830. They are registered with Wells Fargo, and every month $400 goes into a savings account, $230 goes into a checkings account, $100 is put into a 401k for retirement plans, and the last $100 goes into life insurance. My one and only dream which was to possess money, has come true! We chose to put money towards different investments so there will be specific money for any future predicaments. Wheel of Misfortune Someone of your immediate family has just died, so now you have to know the expenses of planning a funeral. An adult funeral can cost anywhere from $9,000 and up. Prices vary depending on whether you want to be cremated or buried, and also on what type of ceremony or funeral services you want.
Well, I guess it's good to know all this stuff, but who's dying? Last Will and Testament of Ariel Davis I, Ariel Davis, presently of Newark, Delaware, declare that this is my last will and testament. To my friends, Catherine, Caitlin, and Angela, I leave a fourth of my money. To my three brothers, I leave all my personal belongings and anything in my room. Also to my three brothers, I leave all my video games, DVD collections, and generally anything in my computer room. And to my children, you get nothing! Lol, just kidding. To my three brothers and children, I leave my house and three-fourths of my money. My children are to be taken into custody by any or all of my brothers. Well, I called up the brothers and they'll be here next week to start taking care of the kids. Um, but the will doesn't say anything about her brothers taking custody of the kids. Uh, yes it did. Here, let me see. What in the world? Did someone erase it? This isn't even her handwriting. What does it say? 